Guys, are you getting really bad performance playing Hogwarts Legacy on the PC? Well, I did and I was able to solve it. Uh, I was playing uh, around with the lowest settings, ray tracing off, everything off, everything the lowest. I'm getting less than 30 frame, frames per second, uh, shuddering, it was terrible. And here you can see me actually trying ultra settings with ray tracing on. Now there are deep downs of course, but considering the difference where I actually got this performance on the lowest settings, uh, we now of course on the lowest it runs much much better and this game looks absolutely stunning with ray tracing on, it's just, it's just so so immersive and I really want to experience it, I mean I should. So let me show you what I actually done, uh, so you can try it yourself and maybe it will work for you. So first of all just want to see, I wanted to see what I'm actually uh, using. Nvidia DLSS. Uh, frame rate, by the way, I changed to uh, later to 144, which is the max frame rate for my um, my laptop. I can actually even change uh, the DLSS to be even better, so it can even improve the performance. I can enjoy ultra quality with ray tracing on. I turned I, off. I don't know, remember. I actually turned it off. I don't remember. I can actually turn it on, but you can also choose ray tracing quality to improve it. Uh, something I'm probably going to do when I kind of a mix and match to find out the best balance. Uh, but overall, as you can see, uh, uh, it's running good. And only because a few things that I actually uh, changed uh, that allows you to actually enjoy playing this at the highest ultra settings. So this is just an outdoor, for example. Again, ultra setting with ray tracing. And uh, yeah, running really well. I mean, considering the fact that I couldn't even run on the lowest setting well. And it's really ruined the experience for me. So let me show you what I did. All right, so these are the thing, things that I've done that I noticed a change. All of the things uh, I made sure that uh, to turn uh, other XLS GPU scheduling on. It was on, by the way, already, but I'm just saying that here in the list, make sure you have it on. Uh, run as administrator. This is the location where I have it on my computer, so you can check it out and right click and run the game. Uh, set our wood legacy to high priority in Windows Task Manager. Uh, by, by the way, make sure you run Windows Tech Manager, Task Manager with administrative um, privileges, otherwise you won't be able to do it. Uh, in the video control panel, do what I uh, mentioned here. And uh, close unused apps, of course, close, uh, turn Windows Game Mode on, which was already on for me. So the other thing was, the things that I've done was actually helped me out to get better performance, much, much better performance. Now again, for example, this is the time where I actually play on the lowest settings. This is the only way I can actually play. And even then, it was so bad uh, and it just ruined my experience. I and mean, this is a game that looks and plays stunningly well. It looks so beautiful when it plays uh, at high frame rates. But when it drops, it just feels so bad. True to many games, but especially here. Yes, yeah, so from that point on, I can already optimize it and run with ray tracing and ultra. Just you need to reduce things that doesn't really affect the visuals and make sure it runs much smoother. Uh, play with DLSS settings and uh, ray tracing quality, and I can actually play at high quality graphics settings. This solved the issue for me, uh, and hopefully it will help you out. So try it out. Tell me if it helped you. Uh, enjoy the game.